Hi there, and welcome to this new video. I've been traveling around Spain in this bus for about six months. All the way from the east side to the south, then along the western border and back up to the north side. And I gotta tell you, this is a stunning country with really, really astonishing nature. And I'm gonna show you which makes this video very nice to watch. But this country also has a dark side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And I'm gonna show you that dark side too. Which makes this video actually a little bit disturbing to watch. But that's the whole point. And at the end of the video, I'm going to tell you a little story that points out this dark side pretty clearly. Welcome to my channel.
I owe you a story, but first I want to clear up two things. All this stuff I threw out of the window earlier in this video, of course that was a joke and I cleaned up afterwards. Secondly, all these braziers. I must have seen about 40 or 50 in the roadside. I can't figure out why Spanish people, Spanish women in this case, would throw out their brazier out of the window into the roadside. If you do know, please let me know in the comments below because I want to understand. Okay, and then the little story. I parked up in Granada in a dead end street. It wasn't very nice because the roadside was packed, really packed with uh, waste. All of the stuff like I showed you earlier in the video. And then a father and a daughter arrived on a scooter. He got off and started to teach her how to ride the scooter. You know, steering, using the throttle, braking, etc. And while she was practicing, he took some stuff out of the roadside. Uh, cans, uh, plastic bottles, 18 items, all waste. And he put it on the middle of the street and formed a track for his daughter so she could practice. And then he came over to me and uh, stood next to me and started giving her clues how to handle the scooter. And while she was practicing, uh, we started to chat a little. You know, the usual stuff about my boss, uh, about where I was coming from. And then he asked me what I thought about his country. Well, of course, in the beginning I was very polite and I told him how impressed I was by the beautiful nature, the nice beaches and the weather, of course. But I also told him how negatively impressed I was by all the waste, all the garbage everywhere, especially the roadsides. And then he let out a deep sigh and said some interesting things. He said the Spanish public space belongs to everybody, which is about the same as it belongs to nobody. And he said, Spanish people, it's just not in their minds to take care of their environment or their surroundings. People in this country are either indifferent or they don't know that they can make a difference. And we still have a long way to go. Wow, wise words from a conscious man. So I thought. Meanwhile, his daughter was ready practicing on the scooter, uh, so he shook my hand and said goodbye and started with her to collect these 18 items in the middle of the street, this waste. And I was, I was really convinced they would throw it into the garbage bin, which was about 30 steps away, but they didn't. They collected it and just threw it back alongside the road. And then they got on their scooter again, waved at me, smiled at me and took off, leaving me behind rather confused and disturbed.